This is probably the most essential accessory for your Switch, and it's cheap too. All right, so let me give you a few scenarios as to why you might want this accessory, which I'll tell you about in a second. But yeah, so if you're like me, then maybe you're very protective of your stuff. You like to keep it pristine, as in immaculate condition as possible, and you like, you know, priding yourself on having it last as long as physically possible, especially if it's a collector's item, right? Let's say controllers. So let's say you've got a, a limited edition controller, or maybe you just want to make sure that your controllers last as long as possible, or maybe you're somebody that lends your controllers to to family right so you've got maybe you've got nieces and nephews or younger brothers and sisters or something like that and maybe they're a little bit grubby maybe they've got Dorito fingers and maybe you know you don't want all those crumbs and grime going all over your thumbsticks or maybe you play with your partner I know my wife has long nails a lot of the time and she tends to dig her nails into the thumbsticks and it ruins them so like the the 3ds little like like circle pad thing that is absolutely munched because her nails have like dug into it right and that's the same with just general controller thumbsticks and that's where this comes in so skull and co have made the thumb grip and the thumb grip well it's exactly just that it's literally a piece of rubber that goes over the thumbstick to protect the joystick essentially you know the, the pad that you put your thumbs on however you're probably saying andy yeah you, you can get these like super dirt cheap sometimes you find them free in magazines and stuff like that it's like yeah but have you ever used those like horrible really like really really nasty cheap ones they don't fit your sticks properly they're not made for like one specific controller they are like just generally made for whatever and they're normally loose they're not normally very good quality and sometimes they just go a bit funny or a bit sticky or whatever well the skull and co grips they are much better because you can buy them for specific controllers so they make them for xbox and playstation but we're talking about switch here and you can use them on the switch pro controller or actually on the joy con so they make joy con versions as well they are separate ones we've got both sets here and they come in packs of six so you get three pairs essentially and they're all different they're not the same so you get different sort of textures on them they're slightly thicker on some of the others and then you get like the double stacked ones Ones. so you may have seen these and if you're thinking what the hell's that like you know I've never seen that before well these basically extend the sticks up to give you further reach so what it does is actually it makes it more accurate so most people just use these on the right stick for aiming but you know I, I have used them on the PlayStation on both sticks because I found it quite nice but it basically gives you more accuracy because there's more movement on the joystick you know the joystick can travel further which gives you more control over over that and that's definitely helpful when you're looking at the joy cons themselves because the joy cons don't have very much movement at all because the joysticks are very small they're not full size whereas if you put these double stacked ones on it gives you that little bit extra bit of accuracy and that will definitely help you in first person shooter games so you've got three different types and they are really good you know the quality is excellent and they're actually made for these controllers so they fit perfectly they, they really do and they look cool as well they come in a range of colors you can get black well you can get just like so many different colors <laughs> it took me ages to reel them off so the way that you use these is you have to turn them inside out so get the grip that you want to use and kind of push it inside out and hold it there with your fingers line it up into the center of your joystick and then let go and it kind of clamps around it now you might have to make sure that it's on there properly you might have to give it a little bit of a wiggle but once it's on there it will not come off i've been using these for absolutely months now like i did a story months and months and months ago about it you know a, a, a short that's what it's called i think it's called on youtube it's a short i did that and i've never looked back since they are so good because like i said they protect your thumbsticks from like people's nails or whatever or just like from wear so that rubber coating on the actual joystick itself isn't gonna just wear off it protects them but it gives them more grip as well these are really grippy and they're not horrible like tacky they're not like Oh, I can't really explain. They're not like sticky rubber, if that makes sense. They're good quality rubber. They give you extra grip and you've got the choice of using your own like preferenced ones, like the double stacked ones for better accuracy or anything like that. They're super easy to use and they're cheap and they come in loads of different colors and they've got skulls on some of them. Oh, not on the Joy-Con ones, but on like the, the Pro Controller style ones, they've got skulls on them and I like that. So I am definitely a big fan. Christina really likes them as well and it's good because she gets extra grip from them and it stops her from 
from you know wearing them down or like pushing a nail into the stick which you know with my controllers if she's using my xenoblade chronicles you know two limited edition pro controller i'm like Ooh. so i've got i've got them on that and i'm all happy now <laughs> Okay, Andy, so how much are they? How much are these, right? So here in the UK, they retail on Amazon for $8.99, or they're around $10 if you buy them directly from Skull & Co's website. So if you're in America, probably buy them from there, or you can buy them from Amazon as well. I haven't checked the price there yet, but you know, they're around $10, and here in the UK, they're $8.99. And like I said, you're getting three sets, so you're getting six different ones. You can mix and, mix and match, you can mix? You can mix and match them too. You can use like, you know, a different one on the right hand side and a different one on the left, that kind of thing. But you've got spares. So it's not like you're just getting one pair. You're getting three pairs here. And I think that's a good like deal, really. It's only a couple of dollars per set and they help protect your controller. They give you extra grip. And in some cases, they give you more accuracy as well. So do you find this useful? Do, do you, are you not like me at all and you don't care and you just let your controllers get absolutely battered? Let me know. I'd like to, you know, I'd just like to know your, your thoughts and opinions. I'm not like that. I like to keep my stuff as pristine as possible and these grips help to do that whilst also giving you better grip. I just like using them myself and they're really inexpensive so I definitely recommend checking them out. But if you haven't seen already, go and check out our other Skull & Co videos which you can, uh, you know, find just here. So go and watch those and make sure to subscribe as well. Definitely subscribe first and then check out these videos. Just do it.